I'm recording this vlog before recording my main channel video for today um, for a couple of reasons because uh, my hair is wet because I showered late because I'm just plain irritable and I need to vent some of that away so it doesn't make it into the main channel and because I am just frustrated with uh, YouTubing and that whole process um, I, uh, I was talking to a very successful YouTube friend about color correction and stuff because I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm following tutorials and stuff. It's not turning out so well. What can I do? And he uh, said something. He's like, um, I think you might be using this as an excuse to avoid, you know, content. And my immediate reaction uh, when someone says something like that is to be like, well, do I swear on these? I, I don't know. I don't know if I swear on these vlogs. But flip you. That that felt much less satisfying. Um, it's my initial response, but I also respect the guy's opinion a lot. So I was like, crap, I gotta think about this. Um, and to an extent, it's true. A lot of, I've not been particularly happy with my content recently. And, uh, I don't know, the, the problem is every time I try and fix it, I don't know what it is that I used to, I, I look back at my old stuff and I see so many problems with my old stuff, I'm like, well, I can't go back to doing that. I look back to my recent stuff and I'm like, eh. um, it's, uh, he also says something else that, uh, it's very easy to tell when there's something that I've kind of rushed out or when there's something that I'm really excited and passionate about. And, uh, I, I really don't want to stop doing three videos a week. I, I kind of need that for me. I need the, the, the process of making videos is always fun, even when I'm not particularly thrilled with the product. Um, so I, I'm not willing to do stuff less frequently, but yeah, it's absolutely true. I'm, I left the friggin', that's not a swear word volume on my laptop before I went to record this, because I am an idiot. Uh, anyway, but it's true that I I lost my train of thought completely. It's gone. Just phew, This is one of those times where I need to just kind of stare off in this direction and go, and then come back and start talking again. Um, but, but I need the I need the process of the making content and stuff, but it's true that I run out of ideas. It's not even that I'm necessarily running out of ideas. I have ideas all the time. I've been making notes and being like, oh, I should do a video about this or do a video about that. But I have no idea how to flesh that out in a way that I'll be proud of. I feel like I have to step things up and I gotta do things in a way that'll be engaging. Obviously, this isn't a good time. It's obvious. You you don't you don't make videos strictly for people's responses, but it's, but a lot of times that can give you a lot of energy and good feelings that you can channel into future videos when a particular video does extremely well. Um, I know that that's certainly been the case for me, and I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I don't think I'm a dependent on other people's blah, 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 blah. But when... Uh, this is a much less low-key vlog. Um, but obviously this isn't a good time for that. Um, I have 5,500 subscribers on the main channel, and maybe a thousand of them watch my videos. I, d I don't know. But I mean, I should go and look at the analytics, but... I tend to get a thousand, fourteen hundred views on any particular video. Um, I don't know how much of that is subscribers, and how much of that is you know when people share stuff out. Um, the summer is just not a good time because people are outside. There's stuff to do. It's you know there's exciting places to be. Stuff I don't know life. Um, so I have to figure out a way to continue to make stuff at the pace that I'm making it, but kind of infuse that energy back in there. Um, and it's, I think this is more just that now that I've been doing YouTube for a while and I have more an appreciation, more of an appreciation for the medium and the challenges and stuff and there, there's a there's a quote by, I think it was Aristotle, that um, the measure of intelligence or that the, the only, something about I'm going to completely paraphrase this, but the, the measure is intelligence, of intelligence is the degree to which you are aware of your own ignorance. Um, perhaps I'm getting smarter uh, because 
the more I make videos, the more I realize why on earth should I even put this out there? There are so many other people that are putting out amazing stuff that is much more worth the time. And for me to saturate the pond with this isn't necessarily a responsible decision. At the same time, there's the selfish like, well, I want to make videos. Um, and if we just, and if, and if we forced ourselves just not to make things unless we thought this was groundbreaking or phenomenal or, uh, wow, this is getting repetitive, uh, or, or something that's just unique or better than the other offerings out there, none of us would ever make anything. Um, then again, we also wouldn't have Troll 2, which might be a win. I honestly, I don't know how people do it. I don't know how writers do it when they write something and you go, this isn't better than Shakespeare. Well, why? There's, there's a part of my brain that's like, if you, if you write something and it's not better than Shakespeare, why release it? Just tell people to go read Shakespeare. Because they've got confined, they've, there's a limited amount of time to do stuff. So I need to get past that. This has been something that, that, that particular complex has been something that I've struggled with for my entire life. Um, I, a lot of times as a pianist is that I would, don't say I'm good, there are other people you should be listening to. D there, um, yeah, that's what's up with me. This is not a cheery vlog. Happy frickin' 4th of July. And uh, I've got some food coming that's going to delay a little bit of time, and then i got to shoot the main video. I've literally gone through about eight different ideas and tried to flesh them out, and I think I'm going back to the first one. We'll see what happens. I think it. I think this one actually may be, may be fairly good. Possibly. I don't know. You guys will have to be the judge. And on the off chance that I'm not being overly pessimistic about my own content, I am absolutely sorry for wasting your time. <sighs> Bye.